What is up, everybody? Jason here with Jaspies. We just sold out another Chase the Mantle promo break. This is uh, 2024 Hit Parade Baseball uh, Autographed Limited Edition Series 14 Dual Case Random Team Number 1. And again, guys, these are a couple of the preview cards there. And again, two cases, 20 total boxes, one card per box. And then at the end, guys, we'll randomize the names and someone gets a chance to win the mantle. So let's do the break first, though, guys. Let's roll it. We got a 6 and a 1 seven times. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Seven times, seven times. Allen, down to Joe. Seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Twins down to the Diamondbacks. All right, so Alan Murdo, you have the Twins. Tyler Sandberg, you have the Tigers. Lasso, you have the Rockies. Junior with the Braves. Ryan with the Pirates. Mark with the Rays. Ferran with the Royals. David with the White Sox. Chris with the Dodgers. Tristan with the Orioles and Yankees. Joe with the Padres. Brett, you have the Mariners and the Angels. Justin with the Blue Jays. Nick with the Guardians. Pat with the Brewers. Tristan with the Astros. Richard with the Nationals. David with the Giants. Emma with the Cardinals. Ryan Stewart with the Rangers. Joe with the A's. Barry with the uh, Mets. Tristan with the Cubs. Kev with the Red Sox. Tristan with the Marlins. Michael with the Phillies. And Joe with the Reds and the Arizona Diamondbacks. All right. So, if you guys want to trade amongst yourself, we'll give you guys a quick minute. If no trade chatter, then close it. Oh, wow. The Sacramento Kings agreed to trade, sign and trade DeMar DeRozan. And then they also sent Harrison Barnes to the Spurs and Chris Duarte and two second round picks to cash and cash considerations uh, to Chicago. Well, there you go, Lasio. You just got Harrison Barnes and Chris Duarte. Oh, sorry, just Harrison Barnes. Then DeMar DeRozan's going to sign a three-year deal, $70 million deal. Oh, he's back in California, just not Southern California. All right, well, last year I'll try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Six 
All right, here we go. All right, series fourteen. All right, here we go. All right, Cubbies, Christopher Morales to start us off. Cubs, when a Tristan. We got a Robin Yao from Definitive, Milwaukee. Uh, that is actually number to 25. Six out of 25. Milwaukee Brewers. That's going to Pat Wolf. We got a Dansby Swanson, five out of five. That's a rookie for the Atlanta Braves. I know it's kind of hard to see it, but ATL Atlanta right there. You can kind of see it a little bit. So Atlanta, that's going to Junior. All right, next one. And we got a Colton Kowser to 199 from Tribute. Baltimore Orioles going to Tristan. And we got Bobby Wood Jr. from Five Star, Kansas City Royals, for on. And then we got a Brett Beatty refractor autograph to four ninety nine for the Mets and a Barry Roberts. And then we got a Corbin Carroll tops now. Road to opening day to 99. Zona. Going to Joe. Case hit. Here we go. Woo! Aaron Judge. From Topps Gold Label. Man, you guys remember Gold Label? This is from uh, 2021. I think that was one of the last years they did it. 
or maybe 2022. But there you go, Yankees. Tris, there you go, man. Got your boy. Then we got it, Pedro Martinez, signatures from Select, Boston. Red Sox going to Kev. Last one here is a wow, little duel, relic and autograph, twenty nine out of thirty five. Jose Altuve and Jeremy Pena, Houston, going to Tris. All right, there you go. Nice case there. So the duel, you got the Pedro, the case of Judge, Corbin Carroll, Beatty, Bobby Witt, Kowser, Swanson, Romanyau, and Christopher Morrell. But there is more. Here we go, one more case. Trans, what's going on, man? How are you, buddy? UFO autograph from Bowman's Best. That's James Wood for the Padres. Padres. Going to Joe. Mike Bobby, what's going on? Jason, what do you think of this Dylan Gabriel character? Oh! What's up, man? Um, I don't know, man. He's pretty good. I mean, he's he had an amazing season in Oklahoma last year, but just obviously didn't win as much as I'm sure Oklahoma wanted to. But um, I think he fits fits Oregon's offense just perfectly, you know. So hopefully, rocks out there. But the Oregon Ducks actually have some good quarterbacks on their roster. So I mean, if it doesn't work out, I guess. Obviously, their future is in good hands. They have some young quarterbacks. Archives. George Kirby to 99. Mariners. Going to uh, Brett. <laughs> I know, dude. They play Michigan this year, right? I, I feel like they do. I, haven't, I don't remember the full schedule, but... But no, man, I, I think the Ducks overall are going to have a really good season, man. I mean, I don't know how many wins they're going to have, but projected to be really good. I mean, especially now with the playoffs extending to, like, that bigger format, they should be in that playoff pool. But, uh, but yeah, I mean, obviously Oregon, you know, fell a little short a couple games, especially against Washington. But um, I, I think they should be really, really good, man, coming out of one of those teams coming from the pack, you know. Overall, defensively, they're going to be great. Offensively, they lost a couple weapons. You know, obviously lost even Bo Nix, but I think Dylan Gabriel would be, could be possibly just as good, if not better. Jordan, nice one there for the Astros going to Tris. But yeah, man, hopefully he does ball out for your card's sake, you know. Get some good money off of him. But yeah, Trans, you uh, got the pool out today, right? At the pool? Sheesh. Yeah, dude, you know, it's funny. My mom is actually up there near Bakersfield. Um, you know, I went to Arizona for the week, but she ended up going with one of her uh, friends out uh, to a campsite. I guess I guess uh, her friend Maria's husband owns, like, this piece of land out there in Bakersfield where, like, there's a little, like, river 
or so, kind of like around there. Yeah, she's like, uh, I have her tracking right here. She's like here in, River, in here. I have no idea where this is at, but in Bakersfield, but she's pretty close, I would like to say. Now I've got to make sure mama's good. Yeah, she's been out there since Wednesday. She'll come back tomorrow. She said it was like 118 the other day. It's like, Jesus Christ. Michael Harris. To 75. Atlanta. Junior. Tell me, what, what, what is it like right there? You been to that area? Mark McGuire, nice. Athletics to 25. Oakland going to Joe. All right, halfway through, guys. And we got Masataka Yoshida. Nice little piece of the lumber and autograph to 25. Going to Kevin, the Boston Red Sox. But well, going back to you too, Mike. You curious how your team was doing if you're in blizzards? Actually, man, it's not like Oregon is just sunny, sunny California, Mike. I feel I feel like uh, USC and UCLA are going to struggle. I mean, Oregon, I mean, raining all the time. I mean, I'm not saying there's blizzards, but it does get pretty cold up there. So I think, I think Oregon will be just fine, man. I mean... You know, also it depends on the time of the year when they play Michigan, right? I mean, if I remember correctly, the last time Oregon played Michigan was like 2006, 2007 with Dennis Dixon, baby, doing the Statue of Liberty. I remember they smoked Michigan in that year. But I, it also depends on the time of the year they're playing Michigan, too. So I'm not sure when they are. But no, I, I don't think Oregon will be affected too much by weather. Like I said, it's not like it's sunny California where it's just sunshine all the time. USC and UCLA, on the other hand, though, I feel like are going to have problems. And look at that. Wow. What a break for the Yankees. Both case hits were Yankees. And going to the Yankee fan, Tristan. Look at that. Young Star Signatures, Derek Jeter. From 2007. That's awesome, man. Congrats. Yeah, I, I don't know exactly. All she told me was that her friend, they 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 have they either they own a lot or they, you know, they, they they have a lot of land there and like they leave their trailers there. So like she, there's like a toy hauler trailer there, an RV there, and like I guess they leave it and fill it up with stuff, you know, with uh, like camping stuff. So when they go there during the summertime, they already have everything there ready to roll, you know. So. She said that there was a little river that goes through there, so she was, she was sending me videos the other day. But she was just saying it was, like, super hot, though. Moreno, silver signatures to 25. Yeah, this lady that my mom went with, we used to go camping all the time. Like, she, we would go to, like, Yosemite together. We went to Sequoias um, when I was a kid, so they definitely liked the camping outdoors kind of deal. But, uh, yeah, it was my mom's first time going somewhere up there. So I was happy. I mean, it wasn't too far of a drive, you know, Bakersfield area. So not that crazy. But, but she was staying in one of their RVs, toy haulers, because, like I said, they had a couple of them. So they were cooking up all the big Mexican dishes, man. They just said they made birria yesterday from there. Machado, 7 out of 10. They had menudo the other day for breakfast. Garnitas they were cooking there. Everything, dude. Crazy. I was like, lucky. Also, too, uh, Orioles. Tristan. 
I'll definitely let her. I did actually tell her that you were nearby, but I mean, she's with the whole group and shit, so. <laughs> I'm sure if she could, she would definitely stop by. But she actually drove with them and stuff. But thank you, though, man. I just told her to drink a lot of water, bro, and hydrate, because it's fucking hot over there. And ended off with a Vladdy Jr. 1 out of 10. Justin Martin with the Blue Jays. A little something there at the end. All right. So there you go, guys. So obviously, this case, Vladdy, Machado, Moreno rookie. You got Jeets, Masataki Yoshida, Mark McGuire, Michael Harris, Houston, the yeah, Alvarez. Kirby and then James Wood. So unfortunately, I don't know how everybody was going to hit, but thanks for still giving it a shot, guys. Now, of course, if you want to redeem yourself or, hey, you hit well and you're like, damn, I want to run this back again, I reposted up the next two cases that we have. And obviously now, not saying that, not saying, of course, that there won't be other hits for, like, you know, say the Yankees per se, but obviously a couple of the bigger ones have been pulled, so that increases the odds for, like, other teams like, you know... The Angels or, you know, the Washington Nationals or, you know, Phillies, etc. Where some of those case hits could still potentially be out there. Um, but yeah, let's switch scenes now. Uh, and, of course, let's do the randomizer here. So, again, one person's going to get in. There we go. Roll it. One and a three, four times... Four times, guys. One, two, three, and four. Four times. Four, four. Oh, sorry, Ryan. But Nick Stanley. I don't know if I called your name, Nick. You yeah, the Cleveland Guardians. Well, you did get the Chase the Mantle spot. So there you go, man. Let's put you in here. And uh, this hip parade MLB, do case number one. So there you go, man. Congratulations. And again, guys, um, there are other breaks that are sold out that we'll be doing in a little bit, guys, if you refer to the break schedule, guys. Uh, like I said, I'm going to take a little lunch break now, but when I get back, I'm going to do the filler that unlocks Immaculate and NT, guys. So thank you.